All righty, ladies and gentlemen. Was reading some more of that wrestling news earlier today's there. SmackDown 1.4 rating, 1.9 something million viewers there, so less than 2 million viewers on SmackDown. Um, very, very, very low ratings. And they're going to bring this shit to Fox or whatever. I don't know if Fox are going to be happy with these numbers there. But, you know, you have absolutely nothing on SmackDown. Once again, Kofi Kingston as the WWE champ. It just, it's not working. Just like Seth Rollins, I didn't see SmackDown because I don't even give a fuck about it at this point because there's no reason to watch it, you know? They took Roman Reigns off of Raw, which is going to hurt the viewership on Raw. So the only star on SmackDown is Roman Reigns, maybe Daniel Bryan, maybe there's people I'm not remembering right now there, but the biggest star right now on SmackDown is Roman Reigns, they have him get beat by a 50 plus year old non-wrestler called Shane McMahon. Yes, Shane wrestles and matches, so technically he's a wrestler, but he's an old man. He's not a real wrestler. If he wasn't the son of Vince, he wouldn't be in the wrestling ring. It's as simple as that. You have the biggest star, one of the biggest stars of the company. You make him get beat by a skinny old man, makes Roman Reigns look like shit. The only star that they have on SmackDown now looks like a schmuck or whatever. You know what I mean? Um, Roman, a hard time getting over. He gets the cancer stuff. He gets over with this, you know. Why not use him if he's over right now? Why not have him in the main title picture instead he's getting beat by Shane to push Shane for what where, where are they going with this I have no idea there but the biggest feud on the show Kofi Kingston versus Dolph Ziggler how the fuck are they supposed to get viewers with this you know what I mean like is this is bad Two mid-carders at best, guys that were just in the mid-card, piss-break wrestlers. These guys, Kofi Kingston is on TV. If I gotta go for a fucking shit, I ain't gonna hold in my shit for this guy. <laughs> you know, especially not when he was just a, a, a regular mid-card guy like he was always was and he should still be there, but... You know, this guy, like I said, if I had to piss, if I had to shit, I wouldn't watch his matches. I wouldn't stay, hold in my pee to watch Dolph Ziggler. You know, I wouldn't have done this. And now you look at SmackDown and this is the main feud. How in the world are they supposed to attract viewers with this crap? Two guys that people don't care about. I mean, really. You know, people were all into Kofi. They're the nerd fans. Real fans don't want this. They're, this is lame. It's cheap. You know what I mean? Real fans don't want this. The nerds are into this. Kofi Kingston. All right. Oh, you don't like him. You're racist. Okay. Viewership. Pa! There you go. There you fucking go. You're killing the world title with this nonsense. Ziggler, one of the most boring Fox, one of the most annoying Fox in WWE history. The guy was never worthy to be a champ. He likes to say that he is there. You know, Vince gave him the, the world heavyweight title. What for? I have no clue there. He got the belt. He got the concussion or whatever when it happened, but... The guy's just an annoying fuck. At this stage of the game, 
Nobody cares about Ziggler. Maybe if he leaves, the people are going to want him to go to AEW or whatever. But right now, nobody cares. You know, nobody cares, man. Okay? Uh, so, why are these two fighting for the belt and this is supposed to happen for multiple pay-per-views? Do they want the company to go under? What's the point of this? You know, who else do they have on SmackDown right now? I, I don't even know, for God's sakes. I don't know. Whoever you, that, that's worthy on SmackDown, they're on Raw every week with the wild card. So there's no reason to even watch SmackDown. You have a jobber fucking champ. In the jobber feud against another jobber, the only guy worth watching on SmackDown is getting beat by an old man. Why am I watching? That's why I don't watch. Tuesday night, I didn't watch. You know what I mean? There's no reason to. So it's bad. It's bad. And Fox are going to pay big money for this. The fuck kind of crack have they been smoking recently? Over there on Fox there, but... You know, Kofi Kingston needs to lose the belt. The title is already worthless. You know what I mean? It's not a question of will the belt become worthless. It is... The belt is officially dead. The WWE title is dead it ain't worth shit anymore. If Brock Lesnar beats Kofi, you know, he might be able to pump some life back into the belt. But then he's going to be gone all year. So what the fuck are they going to do? They should just put the belt on Roman, <laughs> on SmackDown, do something. Because, you know, the belt is dead. The belt is fucking dead. It feels like this whole company is just falling apart. You know what I mean? That's just... It's sad to see there. It was bad before, but not this bad. Now it's... It's... It's worthless. It's not even worth getting mad about. You can't get mad because you know it's shit. It's not a shock anymore. Oh, they did something fucked up. I'm upset. No, you expect that it's bad, so... There's not even enough to make you upset about it. It's just like, ha, ah, whatever. You know what I mean? That that's what that's where I'm at. I'm sure there's two, three guys on Twitter that that still pretend to like this. I'm positive, guys, but that's worthless at the end of the day. The the ratings are going downhill. It's horrible. You know, somebody wrote to me. What are they going to do in the fall? Yeah, it's going to be scary, man. It's going to be fucking scary. Come October or whatever, around that time there. <laughs> They've already have the lowest record of, of viewership on Raw. They've shattered their record, baby. It's all downhill from here. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, it's getting really fucking, you know... It ain't my company, you know, if they, they fucking collapse, it's their own fault, you know what I mean? They choose to suck, you know, they want to get on their high horse. The wrestlers nowadays, they're in, you know, Oi, don't criticize me, they're doubling down on fans shouldn't criticize us, but just enjoy the show. The show ain't enjoyable, I'm sorry. And all the wrestlers suck fucking cock in WWE, apart from a couple. <laughs> so, yeah, enjoy this right here, you fucking bitches. Until next time, peace! Ah!